Hey everybody, Justin Hinnings here and I am part of the Awardos team and we are bringing you another awesome program out there. This one's called the Social Media Quoter and you can find that at www.socialmediaquoter.com and what the program is in a nutshell is basically a very viral powerful social media tool. So you can use this for Facebook and what this will do is we'll grab the most famous quotes out there and put them on an image whatever background image that you would like. You can also set, you can add your own custom quotes to this. You can add your own custom uh, you know, URL to it. So that's way it can always get redirected back to you, whatever website that you would like. Now you can set a scheduler up for this. So that way you can post on a certain time and date. So that way you don't even have to be at the computer. Everything's automated and it's going to be so fast and easy that you don't even know what to do with it. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you have any questions, feel free to ask. All right, everybody, uh, Justin here. I'm going to be showing you a uh, quick tutorial on how to use the social media quoter. Uh, this is a very powerful and viral tool that you just need to have. So what you're going to want to do is obviously click on the shortcut on your desktop after you installed it. And once that's all done, you're going to want to head, click on open social media quoter and click on login now this is the basically the the home page of this program um, if you look on the left you'll see that there's different categories for the quotes um, you can choose whatever you want and basically this program will go out and collect the most popular uh, quotes from people so first thing you want to do is come down here and type in your username and password that is to your Facebook account so this is obviously going to be your email and then your password so after that's done we can start getting our quotes so uh, let's go ahead and pick a category that we're going to want to use uh, for this example um, for the tutorial I'm going to pick oh let's do let's do friendship and so you, we can do uh, quotes to download. We can um, these are how many uh, quotes we're going to download. Well, we'll just do we'll do five for this example, uh, and then after that's all done, you just click on get quotes. And as you can see, I uh, pulled them up very fast. Uh, it gives you the quote, gives you the author, and it also gives you the uh, the option to enable or disable. And I'll show you what that is for uh, later on, uh, just to show you that you can get more than. Uh, more than five so we'll go ahead and clear these and look at that look how fast that pulls up so like I said this tool is a very powerful tool uh, this is how you can go viral on Facebook so uh, this is what we're gonna do we're just gonna go five for this uh, tutorial example um, and then after you get done uh, you can also type in your own custom quote so we'll just type in um, this program is awesome and works flawlessly. So, author, you just type in me or your actual name, and then you click on add. So, if you can see down here, we have now the quote uh, this program is awesome and works flawlessly, and my name. And you can just um, click on one to actually remove it, and that's how fast it will remove it. Uh, and you can unselect all, you can select all, and then uh, let's let's go down to um, where we're actually going to be using. Um, so here is going to be our backgrounds. So we'll browse the backgrounds. Uh, I'm going to be using a um, backgrounds. Uh, you can use whatever you want. Uh, the the program has some built in, uh, but for this example, I am going to be using. Uh, uh, these these ones that I have um, on here so we'll go to my downloads and open so after you clicked on that it's gonna load up all the uh, images or backgrounds into the uh, this spot right here and uh, while that's loading up actually I gotta forgot they're in another folder so as you can see they loaded up uh, there's gonna be five of them and uh, so the next thing we're gonna move to is quote color uh, you can change it to black um, 
change it to green. Uh, for this example, since my uh, backgrounds are brown, I'm just going to change it to white. Uh, then you can change the font. It's that easy. You can lots of fonts to choose from. So uh, we'll do something pretty easy to read. Um, let's see here. Arial's pretty good. Uh, Let's just do, we'll do this one, and uh, we'll keep it at about that. Uh, the size is fine, and uh, we'll do okay on that. Uh, next thing is that you can add a URL to the uh, quote image, which is going to be very powerful. You can link them to your website. So we'll go ahead and uh, do that right now. Uh, we're going to do probably, uh, we'll probably keep it white. Maybe, maybe we'll add... Since it's brown, I'm trying to think of another good color to add with a brown. Let's do uh, let's do this um, baby blue color. So we'll add a uh, URL right here. So uh, we're going to add the URL. Uh, so we'll do www.socialmediaquoter.com since this is the program we're using, and then. Uh, we can click here to post this to your timeline. Um, and the next thing we're going to want to do is we're going to do a uh, um, a URL in the caption. That's going to enable this. We can also add a custom caption on top of everything. Um, out this awesome software. So once that's all done, you're going to want to load up your pages and groups. So you click on this tab and go to reload. What that's going to do is the status says it's going to log in. Successfully logged in and now it's going to pull up all of my groups and pages that I am a, uh, a member of. So another neat thing that this has, um, so we can do unselect all and you can also select all, you can select all your groups uh, I'm only in a member of two groups uh, you can do unselect all again and select all pages which I have a lot more um, and then if you want you can actually you know visit um, the actual uh, page before you you can go to it so this is a uh, Scotty's Go Go Grill, this is some food truck that I liked uh, That's where I live uh, really really good food so just that's basically uh, what you can do uh, before you can actually uh, um, you know that's where you want to post it you can that's where you can make sure that you want to post it so we'll do unselect all and we'll do all uh, we'll, we'll do pages why not so we'll go okay as you can see that loaded it up on all the uh, the pages that I want it so we'll click on quote and caption and custom quote and URL. So, before we all get done with this, um, I'm going to save this project. So, as you can see, it's project one, and uh, we'll just show you basically why you should save them and what it will do. So, we'll go close out of this, log back in. As you can see, everything's gone, but once I click project one, everything loads back up. So. Uh, before we post, I'm going to show you the next thing. Now, this is only for professional and corporate packages. This is uh, this will not be for the light packages. So this is a scheduler. The scheduler will post on a certain time and date that you set it. So just uh, we'll set this up real quickly. Uh, so we'll click on let's do uh, business quotes. So we'll get the quotes pulls them up look how fast that is as you can see the date and time is on there so we'll change this to since it's the uh, it's 116 here we'll change this to just change it to the 19 so about three minutes from now uh, this is fine this is on today's date so we'll go ahead and set time and we set an uh, interval that's how many minutes in between everything and as you can see, look how look how it changed it. So everything's ten minutes posted um, from each other. Uh, if you want, you can click on a certain one, and then you can you can change that certain one. So we can do from thirty. Um, 
so everything's 30. Uh, if you want, you can change a certain uh, time of one. So we'll, this one's on 1419. So we'll do 14, we'll do 1430, and we'll set the time, and that's going to change it. Uh, so you can easily change these. So we'll go back up here. We're going to change it from, uh, we'll do it five minute intervals. So we'll go set. Everything's set. Uh, so we'll go ahead and uh, select our brown uh, backgrounds. Like I said, you can use whatever you want. Uh, this is a great way to uh, go viral. These are very powerful uh, and very neat automated um, images that are going to make uh, you know your Facebook page, your groups go viral, and you don't even have to be there to do it. So we'll go downloads brown brown opens it up opens all the uh, images up and you can use whatever image that you would like uh, like I said I'm just using these for this uh, tutorial video uh, quote we'll change it to uh, white font we'll do something just really easy we'll keep it at Arial um, font color we'll do it to uh, oh we'll just do let's do a pink color it might not look the greatest but we're just gonna do it for and you can change this we're just doing this for examples guys just showing you how this works I will do bookshelf some no we're not gonna do that yeah why not www.socialmediaquoter.com uh, username that's gonna be your Facebook email type in your password Okay, uh, go ahead and get our pages real quick. So all my pages are up, so we're going to unselect all, we're going to select, uh, we'll just do all our pages, click OK, uh, custom caption, testing soft, new software, smiley face, we'll do an URL in the caption, that's going to be our URL up here, we'll do quote in caption, that's going to be these. And we'll also enable our custom caption. So uh, we can also save our uh, project here. So this is scheduler. Uh, we'll just save it scheduler one. Save the project. So now you'll have all that uh, once you're done. Uh, you can also save uh, your login over here, which will be nice to come back to. So that way you can post on more than one account. Um, let's see here. Like I said, you can also add a custom quote on here if you would like. Uh, you can do more than five custom quotes to download. Here we're going to enable um, which quotes we're going to want to post. So we'll just leave the five on there. Now once you're done, uh, you know I can actually post on my timeline if I really wanted to. And I'll do that just to show you that it works. Uh, once you're all done, go ahead and click on Start. Preview the flow of posts. You can go to Yes. And that's going to want. this is what it's going to do. So... First thing it's going to do is going to post one on our uh, timeline, and uh, this is the delay. We have it set as one minute uh, delays in between each post. You can change that to whatever you would like. Um, so that's going to be the flow of post. So I'll go ahead and exit that out. Continue posting and sharing. You'll want to click yes. So we've got a total of about 135 uploads to our 27 uh, pages and a total of qu five quotes. So this is how many minutes you can you can do in between each post, so that way you don't um, and uh, so that way you don't get banned or you get, don't get limited or anything like that from Facebook. Uh, as you can see, the status is posting uh, this on my home page, and you can stop these at any time you want. Uh, we'll just let this run for a little bit, just to show you. So we'll go to my Facebook home page. And once that's done, we'll show you that it's uploaded. So let's go ahead and see. As you can see, I just reloaded that, and it just posted. So there are no secrets to success. Uh, this is just a quote. As you can see, this is the quote that we did. Here's the link to the, the program or our, your URL. And this is also into the, um, into the quote itself. So, very great way to go viral. Uh, famous quotes are always eye-catching and let alone 
touches the hearts of your users. So that's why we use it. Um, like I said, this is going to post, um, you know, every every minute on all these uh, on all these. So we can stop these at any time. Um, let's go ahead and see. So we posted one on our timeline. That's this one. Now I do believe that we posted one. on here but we're gonna have to post to page as you can see that was posted about a minute ago so guys a uh, great program very easy to use and I would recommend it for everybody uh, this is the social media quarter uh, and you can go find that at socialmediaquarter.com get it before uh, you know before it becomes uh, you know super popular because uh, you know you never know when it will be uh, not available so guys, that's that's the social media quarter, and uh, thanks for watching the tutorial video. So guys, I hope that you enjoyed the video. That was the social media quarter, and you can always find us at www.socialmediaquarter.com.